Diastolic heart failure is a condition that occurs when the muscles of the heart are not able to relax normally and do not allow blood to flow easily in the lower left chamber. As a result, the upper left chamber may not fill easily with blood coming from the lungs, causing an increase in pressure. The interatrial shunt device is designed to reduce the pressure in the heart by allowing blood to flow between the two upper chambers, called the left and right atria. The device is placed by an interventional cardiologist using a small tube called a catheter that is inserted into a blood vessel in the groin area and advanced over a guide wire into the heart. The catheter is used to create a very small opening in the heart wall between the left and right atria. The catheter is then withdrawn, leaving only the guide wire in place in the left atrium. The interatrial shunt device is advanced over the guide wire and positioned through the small opening in the heart wall. The implant is then deployed in a controlled stepwise fashion, forming a small passage between the atria. The delivery system and guide wire are removed, while the implant remains securely in place. Blood now flows from the high pressure left side to the lower pressure right side, potentially lowering pressure in the left atrium, which may reduce the symptoms of heart failure. The interatrial shunt device is designed to improve quality of life by reducing breathlessness and fatigue.